Hello everyone, welcome to Roman Theory and welcome to this new series where every day for five minutes I'm going to react to the biggest news in the world of football on a global level. Premier League, Serie A, Bundesliga, Champions League, everything related in this new series. Today's topic is Antonio Conte and Tottenham's potential decision to sack him during this international break. Um, the first thing which I'll say is that I personally think Conte wants the league and I'm pretty sure everyone knows this. I feel like the board has understood after several declarations on press conferences that Antonio Conte wants to leave. He wants to get back to Italy and that Conte does not feel like Tottenham is ambitious. Um, Conte doesn't feel like Tottenham is ready to win trophies. And Conte is a pretty successful manager, if you ask me. Uh, he won the Scudetto in Italy with Inter a few years ago. Um, he won the Premier League with Chelsea. He's, he, he won the Scudetto with Juventus too. He knows how to win. And the second he was appointed as Tottenham manager, he got the impression that Tottenham was a team which really did not have the ambition to try and fight to win the league. And this is kind of who Tottenham are. You know, from the day they sacked Mourinho before that Carabao Cup final, it really puts to mind that Tottenham have got this remarkable history of not winning trophies. And you see the budget that Tottenham have and you're like, Things don't link well together. For the past five years, Tottenham has been carried by Harry Kane and Helm Min Son. Um, the reason why Tottenham has been playing in Champions League football in these past years is just and only because of these two players. This season, Helm Min Son, the Korean, isn't even playing well. And Harry Kane is the only one who's trying to drag this team into a top four position. Conte understood that this can't be right and he wants to leave, he wants to get back to Italy. In fact, there is a video of him um, in a Ryanair flight as soon as the international break started and there is already a meme going on that Conte is um, trying to find the cheapest Ryanair flight to escape from Tottenham's reign. But uh, I, just, I just feel like you see that what, what Conte has said in his latest press conferences, in his latest uh, match interviews and I think that is sending a message to the ownership that if they want to sack him he's not going to complain he's kind of asking for the sack you know after um, the draw against the uh, what was it Southampton this weekend Conte really outclashed Tottenham in his press conference he said that things have to change that the mentality is wrong, that it's the player's fault that they don't play as a team, it's the ownership fault. He's pointing the finger at the players, he's pointing the finger at himself, and he's also pointing the finger at the ownership too, at Levy. Now, I also think what happened with Richardson a few weeks ago is significant. Um, for a manager to blast a player, a component of your team like that, I think breaks the changing room and I feel like after the Richarlison episode and what Richarlison said and what Conte responded to him, I feel like something broke between the players and the manager. If you have a manager who wants to leave and then the players are going to start playing against the manager because the players play for the club. Um, I'm reading the potential substitutions and apparently Fabrizio Romano has said that uh, Glasner, the Eintracht Frankfurt manager, is set to be appointed in case Tottenham decide to fire Conte this weekend. And I just think he won the Europa League with Eintracht Frankfurt, but apart from that, Tottenham deserves more. Tottenham are a team which need to fight for the Premier League. Tottenham are even a team which, to be fair, should be fighting for Champions League too. To, to, to win the Champions League and appointing a manager like Glasner who's coming from a team like Antrak Frankfurt is not going to give you good results um, but yeah I mean this is my impression on Antonio Conte will Tottenham sack him this week during the international breaks um, the rumours are there Conte wants the sack so let me know in the comments if you think it will happen and also let me know in the comments who you think Conte's replacement should be and also, I invite you to smash the subscribe button to this channel. If you're a Roma fan, this is the Roma fan channel. But I'm also adopting this series where every day for five minutes I'm going to speak about the global news of football. So subscribe to the channel, smash the like button if you're a Tottenham fan. Or if you just enjoyed this video, it would support me a lot. And uh, I will catch you very, very soon. Simon.